Hello and welcome to the Great White Builder. Today we are going to be building a brand new world in city skylines called the Rockies. Now I am super excited about this map because it's honestly, um, it's the first map that I've ever downloaded from the Steam Workshop and like tried to use. So that's kind of exciting. Two, um, this is, you know, my first YouTube video obviously. And uh, while I was looking at maps, um, and being like, oh, like I'm gonna make this video, I'm gonna try to, you know, do this thing. I came across this super cool map by the Bringer of Fire. It is Revelstoke 2022. Um, so if you have ever been to Canada, if you're from Canada or, you know, you've ever been to British Columbia and you've driven through uh, on the Trans Canada Highway, you will have crossed a town called Revelstoke. Super small town, really, really beautiful. Obviously it's in the middle of the Rocky Mountains in the, in the middle of the valley in between these mountains. Absolutely gorgeous place. I saw this map and I was like, 100% I have to play this map. I, I'm from Ontario, I live in Toronto. And BC is just the greatest place on earth. I, it, it has my heart for sure. I got married in Alberta and my wife and I spent our honeymoon in, in Peachland near Kelowna. Um, I go snowboarding in the Rockies uh, once a year. It's just, it's an incredible place. If you've never been, please go. Um, even if you're in the States, you know, and, and you've never been to Colorado or any of those, um, you know, Utah, or I, I don't, to be honest with you, I don't know my American geography, so you'll have to forgive me, but you know, go to the, go to the Rockies, they're gorgeous. But I digress. I was super excited to play this map. Um, and I haven't gotten very far with it yet. So I'm very excited. We are going to be doing things a little bit differently though. Um, and you may be wondering what I'm talking about. Well, we're not going to be recreating Revelstoke, even though that, that would be cool and it would serve a purpose. Um, definitely not going to be doing that if I'm, if I'm being real with you. Um, I just don't think that would be very fun. Um, what we are going to do though is build like a city like Vancouver or if you've ever been to Kelowna in this area. Um, so Vancouver obviously is a metropolis in BC. Um, it's right off the, um, the ocean, right on the mountains, very beautiful city. Kelowna is like a very happening city right now. It's been building out pretty quickly over the last like, you know, 10, 15 years. Um, and you know, they have, they don't have like skyscrapers, but they have high rises. And I, I, I love going there because I love to see high rises and skyscrapers in the mountain ranges. I just think that's a really cool aesthetic. Um, being from Toronto, like I love, I love skyscrapers. Um, I would love to go to New York. Like I, I just think they're really cool, um, and I've always loved them in in mountain ranges. I just think that's really cool. So that's what we're gonna do here. We're gonna build that out. Now, where will that be? Over here, over here, over here, probably everywhere. Um, and we're just gonna have a lot of fun with it. Um, I've done this a few times. Yeah, I mean, we're just gonna we're just gonna have tons of fun, and I'm super excited for this map. Luckily, because it is fan made, um, and the person who made it is actually from Revelstoke. There's all of these roads are like legit. This river is legit. Like this actually looks super super cool. And on the on the Steam Workshop page, they actually have these farms. So these actually obviously aren't real farms in the game. They're real farms in real life, but those don't those don't matter. <laughs> um, these farms, they have them named, and then I don't know what they were, but then these farms are named as well. Um, and they also put in this dam, which is the Revelstoke Dam, which is super cool. I love, because the game is paused, these like icicles facing upwards. I just think those are so funny, and I, I wish they existed in real life, because I would love to see them. What a phenomenon. Um, but once we play those, we'll go down, and this will start to wishy 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 washy. Anyway, so... <laughs> <laughs> this is not my first time recording this. Um, let's begin. Uh, first of we are going to, we're gonna, so how we're gonna start the city is we're just gonna keep it very basic to begin with. Um, we're gonna keep it kind of in this area over here, left of the train tracks and right of the highway, you know, just in between here. Um, luckily this bridge is already here. So we don't have to worry about like, you know, crossing and how like, you know, quote unquote expensive it would be in real life. Um, I would like to keep it as realistic as possible, but um, I am not a city planner. So I don't know how much things cost. Um, that's just, that's just the truth of it. I do not know how much things cost. 
So we're just gonna, to start, we're just gonna extend this street. And this is gonna be, this is gonna be our like main street. Um, this is where we'll build, this is where we'll start building and have a lot of fun. Right off the bat, what we're going to do, and this may not be the most realistic thing, and sue me, but um, we're going to place, you know, we're gonna do this a little bit differently later when we have more money. I've done this a few times and I've run out of money almost every single time I try to do this. So this episode is gonna be a stingy one, but we're gonna put the pump over here. And then we're gonna put the Drano, which is the most disgusting thing in the world. And I can't even believe we're, we're, we're placing this in the mountains. Like this would be, you'd go to jail for life. Um, but we're gonna place this anyway because it's a game and I will not go to jail. I am these people's god. And we're gonna start laying some pipe. Again, this may not be the most realistic thing, uh, but uh, you know, that's, that's sometimes the way it is. And I'm gonna put this right by the river for now. And then we're gonna come over here until we're under the road. Now, eventually, we're going to have a public works, a public works area um, where we have water, we have you know waste processing, garbage, and we have electricity. Once we reach, um, once this dam kind of you know reaches its its end point for us, there we go, um, and and then we'll be able to you know move these because I, I really hate where these are, I think it's super ugly. But honestly, once you do this, you don't even see them. So like, what's the deal, you know? You know it'd be kind of funny actually, and um, I don't think I'll do this, but unless unless someone's like, I think you should, it'd be funny to build like a, a crater in here and that's where you store all the poop. But we're not gonna do that. I literally just said five minutes ago that we're gonna keep this realistic, so. <laughs> that's what we're gonna do. Now to start off, We are going to put on road guidelines and then uh, we're going to come over here and that takes away. Yep. So we're going to do that. And uh, we're going to come out. Perfect. We're going to come out 11 units here and then we're going to go down 16. So. And there's a reason for that. Um, so again, 16 by 11. And then here, what we're actually gonna do, we're gonna do something different. We're gonna go, we're gonna come up 10 units, and then we're gonna go up 16. And the reason for that is eventually, I would love to turn this main street into a for you road uh, and upgrade it down. Um, but for now, we are keeping it at a one. And so, I mean, eventually we're gonna have to use some uh, eminent domain, but, um, that way we have this extra tile on either side to turn this into a for you. And we're not, you know, I, I like the four by four unit homes. I don't want to do any threes, especially out here. Like, I mean, not that it's a cheap place to live, but you know, you, you're in the country, right? Like this is, you don't, you don't, you don't come out here and, and buy a shack unless you do. In which case, you know, all power to you, it's your life, but <laughs> I, uh, these people in this fictitious game will not do that. I will not allow them. So again, 10 by 16. I'm just gonna build up the grid real quick. We need to make sure that our water pipes are all gravy. Bring that down. Bring this down. Now we're gonna bring this over. That's just to make sure that we have water over here. Now we're going to do this and we are going to start building. And play. Now while this is building out, I'm just gonna zone a little bit more and you'll notice that I'm just putting a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of commercial right here. That's one because Oh my god, I have to tell you what all of our mods are. <laughs> <laughs> Here's 
Here are all of our mods. Um, these are pretty standard, to be honest with you. TMPE, move it, you know, um, Harmony intersection marking tool. The one big 81 tiles, obviously. Um, the one big one that we are going to be using is realistic population. I just love this one. It just makes a little bit more sense to me. Um, the way that the game is balanced without it, you just have so much commercial and industri industry. It's kind of ridiculous. Um, I, I just, yeah, I just think it's kind of ridiculous to be honest with you. Um, and we're not going to do that because I think it's dumb. So, and I like realistic population. It also like Loki kind of makes me feel like it's more realistic. And I mean, it's called realistic population, so it's probably true, but I don't know. I just, I just like it. And uh, I'm gonna do it. Now, one thing that I totally forgot is we're gonna have to pause real quick. Uh, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to make sure that these little guys have power. Um, and I could do, how much does this guy cost? Six grand. Yeah, I do not have money for that. How much do these cost? 20 cells per six. 20, 600 would be what? Or 63 times three, 10, 300 times two, 600. Yeah, okay. So what we're doing. Oh. Too much, that's it, too much. We're coming over here, coming on the highway, and then we're just gonna run this along the highway. And this is just to make sure that our citizens have water. You know, you would think, living right beside a, a lake, that you would have water. <laughs> you would think. And we're coming down here, and bam. Perfect, okay, so now everyone has water. Now we're, now we're chilling. Now we are good. Now we're gonna, just gonna let this run for a minute. Um, and while we're doing that, I'm gonna come over here. And I'm gonna turn these way down because if we do not, we were we are quickly going to run out of money, like so fast, it's crazy. Ah, yes, and I remember what I was telling you. You may look at these two and be like, why do you only have this small amount of commercial? Well, one, we have zero demand. Two is because I want to fill in all of the residential. We have more residential area here than on this side, obviously. Oh, well, actually, maybe not, but the point is, <laughs> um, in order to get the power to jump other than using one of these transmission lines, which is already here, and to be fair, probably something that I just could have done, um, I want to use commercial to jump the power because I honestly hate these transmission lines and I want to get rid of them as quickly as possible. Now, while this is going on, I know that our, uh, our industry is going to start filling up soon. So we are going to build some roads. And we're going to take that out about 10 units, 90 degree. And then we're actually going to go, uh, actually, what we're going to do is now we're going to go up and we're going to keep to our 10 by 16 grid. And then bam. And this will be maybe an ugly intersection. Maybe an ugly intersection. I don't know. You know what? It, is it? Yeah, it is. So what we're actually going to do is we're gonna come over here and then we're gonna come down and we're gonna come in at a 90. Bam, and that's much nicer. And then we're just gonna build this up. Again, going 10 by 16. We may overbuild some infrastructure. Um, that's gonna happen, if I'm being honest with you. I'm hoping this power just jumps. I think it's, I don't know if this is close enough or not. If it's not, what I can do, oh, I think it is. Oh, what the hell are we? Oh, there we go. You have to grab the outside one. Haha, <laughs> I see. It is, okay, perfect. Honestly, if it's not, I can just move it closer. This is fantastic, I love mods. I may use them when I don't need to, um, and that's just how it's gonna be. So while well, this is this is doing its little magic, see, now we have the power that has jumped from this side over to this side, 
and now we can start filling all this residential in while this industry starts coming in. Um, and luckily the creator of the mod has this nice little roundabout that exists in real life too. So this is like real life stuff going on, uh, which we will actually end up changing some things around because I don't like how this looks. No disrespect, um, but uh, this roundabout uh, could definitely be nicer. The, everything else looks great though. Fire, if you are if you somehow start watching this, <laughs> I think everything looks great. Except this god awful roundabout. Um, these roundabouts are actually kind of cool though. I, I kind of do like how they're, they're one lane. And the, the lane mathematics are a little weird, but I think they're kind of cool. I'd like to see how they like handle stress, but, uh, but yeah, it'd be fun to watch the traffic go by. Now the one thing that will take a little bit of time is because we are on realistic population, getting our population at any sort of milestones is going to be quite the hassle. Oh, and that is not perfect. Oh, it's not perfect anyway. Um, yeah, and that's just kind of how it's going to be, if I'm being honest with you. Um, so we just kind of need to, you know, keep growing and keep building and you know, keep doing our thing. Now for this road, I th think what I'm going to do is bring it down. Now, let me think. We actually might do this. I think this is what we're going to do. Yes, yes. So we're actually gonna come over here. Cause I don't wanna disrupt this, this creek at all. Um, and we probably will because I don't know what I'm doing. But you know, I, I would like to, I, would, I don't wanna disrupt it as much as possible. Now, I mean, obviously we're gonna take away all these trees and I just said in the beginning of the episode that we weren't going to and I, I didn't want to as much as possible, but you know what? That's the way, that, that's just, that's how it's gonna happen. So how we're going to start this is I am going to start this road and I'm just kind of bring it down the river and we're going to bring it all the way down and we may delete some of this later. We may look at this and say, actually, this isn't what I wanted. You know, we may maybe even move some of this. You know what? Let's delete all of this. I don't want to mess with move it unless I absolutely have to. I'm still learning the mods as well, so you'll have to uh, you have to go easy on me. I'm actually going to start it here, and maybe maybe we'll do road. Uh, we'll do we'll do some free farm. Yeah, let's stop it about here. And this will kind of serve as the edge of this road right here. Now we're gonna bring this a little bit back and we're gonna curve this. Actually, maybe what we, do, what we do is we bring this forward, honestly. And then zigzag it in. I think that is what we do, just real quick. Yeah, that looks super freaking ugly. So we're gonna bring this in about three units here, and then let's let's curve road. Let's bring that in, and that looks kind of cool actually. Here on this road, this is pretty sick. I like that. I like that a lot. Cool. And then what we can do is go in here. Notice that we have zero dollars. Oh my god, what are we doing playing with roads right now? Um, honestly, what am I doing playing with roads right now? Let's, let's try to make some money real quick. <laughs> now we've got a high demand, it seems, for people. I really hate these factories in the I just think it's like, come on, that's not. <sighs> Fault tech. Yeah, that doesn't sound good. You know what I'm saying? But I, I mean, I suppose it is what it is. So now while we do this, I wanna have this road kinda come in. 
what I want to do is I want to have this main I want to have this mainstream main street kind of kind of comes you know what this is slightly embarrassing but what we're going to do is call a giant mulligan on this right here I know what you're thinking why would you ever do that and the answer is I don't know the answer is because I'm doing my gosh darn best you know I, I, I'm doing my best that that's the honest to God answer and we're gonna zone this all commercial and then we're gonna zone this side commercial and then we're gonna zone all of this just like this now we're gonna bring these water pipes down and I'm out of money perfect but we are positive so now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna let this run for a bit let this fill out and uh, once we've gained a little bit of money and we're gonna then, then we're gonna have some fun Now the reason I took out this road that uh, that came across the riverbank, even though I think it actually would be very beautiful, and you know, and you know what, and you know what, maybe we will bring something like that similar in the future. We'll probably have one that comes a little bit diagonal and meets up with this grid here. I want this road to be able to come down and possibly cross this river and meet up with this road down the line. Let's notice, look at this little area right here. This would be, this would be awesome to play in. Play in? <laughs> Fuck, how old am I? It would be awesome to fish, fish in. And we start to see some cars coming down here. Let's see, how is this, how's this going? We have people coming around, coming in here, bam. Yeah, like that, I think that actually works pretty well. I know I was kind of pooping on it earlier, but. I think it does work pretty well. And now we can see that we don't really have anything other than residential demand. So let's start filling this in, shall we? Uh, we're starting to get some money. We're starting to make some good cash. We have 356. I think that's not bad, to be honest with you. We're gonna leave this rock here because I kind of like it, to be honest with you. 10, 16, bam. Now with this road. It's gonna, it's gonna pretty much be all houses over here. And how close are we? We are, how many? Nine. So we're done. This is it. Which actually is probably pretty good. And we may upgrade this road down the line and add some trees across here and, you know, make this like um, one of these, uh, one of these walled roads. But, you know, for now, for now we'll leave it. Um, and then let's, uh, yeah, let's build out the grid here. All right, so the grid's pretty much done out here. Um, and that's really cool. So what we're actually gonna do here real quick, cut off water access to these, these fine citizens. Don't worry, it's coming back. Bam, done. Um, what we're gonna do over here is, we're just gonna zone. We're gonna zone some green, zone some homes. And we're taking out that rock, I'm sorry. But it's just gotta happen. And then, we're coming across here, and how ugly would this be a hundred? Oh, it would. Oh, and we're Little Hamlet, look at that. 420 people. We now have birthday plazas. That's not important. We have landfill sites. We have elementary school. We have a medical clinic. That is awesome. And, actually, that's awesome. So we got tons more money which is really nice so we're gonna come and bring these over and then at this point we're gonna we're gonna change things up and these intersections pretty bad if I'm being honest with you oh wait these are miles let's change that can we change that let's check uh, I don't think it's there 
graphics. Gameplay. That's fun. Canada, again. Oh, cool. We're in Canada. Oh, it's 30 kilometers. Wow, these are slow roads. I would, oh my God. If I had to drive these roads, I would. Speed. <laughs> Definitely speed. Um, you know, I know these intersections are pretty ugly, but honestly, unless like if it if it becomes something major down the line, then we'll switch it up. Or if honestly, like if anyone is looking at this and throwing up in their mouth, then you know we can we can go from there. Um, but I, I think we're gonna keep them as is for now. That being said, make sure that the water pipes are in these roads. We're gonna turn these off and we're gonna bring these down. Too. This may be a little redundant, but again, so be it. And again, we're not gonna we're not gonna zone across the river or on the river just yet. We may in the future. Those would be highly valuable lots. Uh, and if I'm being honest with you, I would want to live there. So we might do it, but for now, but for now, no. And that's honestly just because we want to preserve this for as long as possible um you know once we once we take this road over maybe we'll go that way that intersection is going to be god awful at that point <sighs> we will cross that bridge when we get to it <laughs> and uh yeah let's zone let's zone over here and then we'll take this and bam We'll come over here. Perfect. And uh, we're gonna let this run pretty fast for now, just so that we can get up. And while we're here, let's take a look oh, at our schools now. Ooh, actually this is a perfect spot. I like this. We're gonna put the school right there. And we're actually going to D zone right here and then D zone over here. And we're gonna we're gonna figure something out. I don't know if this is big enough for a park to be. Actually, to be quite frank with you, it may not be. Um, but maybe that. Maybe maybe we'll figure something out over here. And then we're gonna go in the medical clinic. Again, these will be off the main drag. Um, ooh, actually. Speaking of such, I should move this over one tile if I can, and I cannot. So maybe actually what I do is move this completely and disrupt a whole bunch while I do it. Or I could put it right here. Actually, I think right here might be a better spot just because it's a little bit more centrally located. And then I can come in here and rezone this area. Perfect. And again, we're just gonna let this run for for half a minute and just see kind of what happens. We will eventually also start doing up here, uh, but then we're gonna have to take out these power lines and I just wanna, not that I'm, I don't wanna do that, I just want to be ready for it. Because what we may end up doing before we come over here is somehow connecting the power, jumping it across this, this road right here. Um, and that way these aren't giant cul-de-sacs and you can kind of get around in between them because right now the traffic would, I mean, it's not very busy, but it would, it would probably be pretty bad. Also, I don't think I mentioned this earlier, but oh my God, our, oh, we only have 50. This is a horrible. I thought it was 200, it was 200 at one point. Oh my God. Okay. Well, we're, we're, again, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. But we have power from this dam, and it is okay. Oh, and we have a landfill I forgot to place. So we're gonna put this landfill right over here. And eventually we're gonna change over to incineration plants, and that'll be in our public works area. But for now, the landfill will do. And yeah, this area over here is gonna be pretty industrialized for the time being. 
um, we'll build, you know, along the coast here, or the coast, I don't think it's the coast when it's on a river, but uh, along the river bend, that's kind of how we'll hang out. Ooh, what building is leveled up, how exciting. A level two home. Very cool, realistic population, one household, that's so fun. Oh, this is cool, I've never been in here before. Oh, oh, and you have different houses. Oh, that's so interesting. So much, so much in this game. It's like you're learning all the time. It's really, really cool, actually. All right, so I see that we have a little bit more industrial demand. Now, I'm going to zone over here, and then I'm gonna come over here, and we're gonna, we're gonna start building up the grid a little bit north of this, just in case we end up somehow with our residents being, you know, up to here, I would like a little bit of room. You know, if we could keep, if we could do residents below here, that'd be really nice. Oh my God, and we're so quick. So we got some new stuff. We got the fire department, the police department. That's really nice. New policies, that's really cool. And we have industries. This is actually really exciting. I love industries. That is really, really cool. Oh, we need water. Oh my God. Can you imagine me as your city guy? I'm doing this all wrong and we're gonna have to fix these water pipes at some point. Um, what I'm going to do, I'll do across there and then I'll do across there. Yeah, these are all wrong actually. Let me do this real quick. And I know I said I want it to be as realistic as possible. I mean, that's just not gonna happen, if we're being honest with each other. Perfect. And again, we're not gonna zone this, but we'll, we'll zone a bit of this. And um, I don't think we're gonna get to the industries now, but why does this have no water? Oh, interesting. Is that connected now? It looks like it's connected. Yeah, it is. Weird. Anyway, uh, yeah, I don't think we'll get to the industries now, but it is really nice to know that they're here. Actually, let's take a look at the industries. Oh my God, look at all this ore. Jeez, oh my God, it's all in the water. Can you even get ore from the water? I don't know, man. This is really cool. Yeah, I don't know, oh, it's so sick. I don't think we're gonna take out a mountain. Um, oil, look at the oil, oh my God. Is there offshore oil? That's crazy, dude. Okay, yeah, we'll figure something out. I, I do actually, I would love to build an ore mine. Ooh, actually, maybe like something in this little pocket right here. That could be really cool. Um, we won't do it now. And I don't really want to do farmland. I know there's a little bit of farmland over here. What we'll probably do is a forestry industry. Now, this is going to be super, super difficult. Uh, I'll also look at this a little bit later just to see, but yeah, there's tons of tons of forest. That is really cool. Maybe something even there that looks a little bit more flat. We'll figure it out. We'll definitely do a, an industry at some point because I desperately want to get rid of this uh, this industry zone right here. I, I really dislike industry zone. Yeah, I really dislike industry zones. I, I do not like them. Um, so we're gonna look at uh, services and we can't do anything else. Those are just our policies. And uh, we are in need of residential. So we're going to continue to build residential. Oh, and we can actually come right over here. How convenient. We're just going to keep building this grid out. At some point, we are going to have to answer to my god-awful um, water pipes. But uh, I don't know if today's the day or not. If that goes, does that look fucking straight to you? Oh, it's up a hill. <laughs> I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? That'll be, well, actually, I don't trust myself. Yeah, well, who knew? And uh, then we're gonna start zoning again. Zone, zone, zone. Actually, we should look at water pipes. Yeah, it's 
pretty good, honestly. We'll probably we'll, we'll connect up this road. I don't know why I didn't do that, to be honest with you. Eleven, perfect. Um, and then what we're going to do is actually cut this connection because we do not need it anymore. Perfect. I love getting rid of those power lines. It makes me unbelievably happy. And then we're going to go up 16 and then over 10. And now we're going to zone in here. Um, maybe actually, maybe we'll do some parks in there, but not right now. And then we're going to come up. Uh, what is this? 32 over, bam, over here. Make sure our water is okay. Perfect. And we're not going to zone these houses yet. Although we will one day, and uh, there we go. Again, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll, maybe I'll do one more. Perfect. And where are my water pipes doing? We are chilling. Going four, and then coming over here. Perfect. So, how's our school looking? We're looking good for schools. Um, obviously, none of that. Over here, we are chilling. Oh my god, I actually got police department and fire department that I forgot to put down. Now, where should we put this? I think what we're going to do, fire safety. I think we're gonna have these right across the street from each other. And uh, forgot to move this. And perfect, now we're good to go. The power has jumped and we are chilling again. And now we're gonna wait for this to kind of, uh, to kind of go up. Oh, and actually I can zone all of this stuff too. Uh, while we are here, I'm going to make this quick connection there, and uh, we're going to continue the zone. That's totally on an angle. 100% on an angle. Oh, I did not need to do that, though. Yeah, that was a thousand percent on an angle. And then that's just up a hill. So that's just the way that it is. And we are zoning all of these. Honestly, I should probably have left room for a park somewhere. Maybe that's what we'll do right here, in which case we can take off all of that. But you know what? Hopefully that doesn't, I didn't just demolish that building. We're safe for now. You. That's okay. Yeah, so now we have this one little strip of land here that we can make to, to increase this. We're gonna let this run for a bit while we kind of think about what we're gonna do for the rest of this build. Um, obviously we already have kind of a grid structure here and it is a little bit different and I, I do like that. It would kind of it would kind of mess things up over here. Um, these will eventually come over and, and make intersections, which will be quite nice. Um, like I said over here, we're gonna we're gonna upgrade these highways. This is not the Thompson Highway. Oh my God, this is the Trans Canada Highway. Unless it is the Thompson Highway, I don't think so. Canada Highway. Uh, this way it would be going north, and then this. Bit. I should make sure that this is actually the Trans Canada. Actually, south, no, east and west. This would be east, and this would be west. Forgive me, guys. West. This still says north. This also says Howard Highway. What the freaking heck? West, enter. Okay, then here. See how far this goes. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's the frickin' Trans Canada, man. What are you talking about? Yeah, because none of these other highways are even... Yeah, no, it's 100% the Trans Canada. Like, what are you even saying? No, bud, you know what I'm saying? What did we look over here? A winter market. Oh, how fantastic. A winter market. Oh, yes. This is amazing. We need parks. Oh, we're almost gonna get that. So let's, uh, let's... Let's get that, okay? We are we're running a little low, but that is okay, which means that we can add a little bit more housing. So let's fill this in. And this actually comes over to 12, which truthfully is kind of nice. So we'll have a little bit more of a break in here, um, but that actually worked out really, really nicely. Oh my God, that worked out nicely. And then, uh, this is kind of exciting. Bam, done. Now, this is not a cul-de-sac. How fantastic. Let's bring these over. And we're gonna come up over here and there. Perfect. And again, we'll leave commercial along this, this corridor here. And you know what, let's just add that in now, just because, and then we can add all of this as residential. And then over here, oh, I don't love what I did there. Oh, and we reached Tiny Town. Perfect, absolutely amazing. We have uh, some new industry areas. We have some more roads, that's very exciting. Um, I like that, I like that a lot. We have some parks, that's really cool. We have a high school, we have a public library, we have some basketball courts, a dog park, oh my God, park maintenance building, amazing. This is this is cool. Um, and we can have a little bit of fun with that. Maybe we'll build like an actual park somewhere. Maybe this can be a park. Ooh, I like that, I like that, or that. Maybe, you know what? <laughs> Why not lots of parks? You know what I'm saying? This is our city. We can do whatever we want. But guys, that is gonna be that. Thank you so much for watching. Guys, if you liked the video, like the video. If you loved the video, comment down below. I would absolutely love to see if you actually watched this and if you enjoyed it. Um, episode two, you know, if, uh, if, if you guys are watching, episode two will be out in a couple days. Um, you know, uh, subscribe, please. Um, and again, just leave me a comment, just, just say hello. You know, tell me, tell me if I did something that you don't like, you know? If you were like, hey, I don't like this road maybe i'll change it because i actually hate this road too anyway guys thanks for watching peace out